Simon Lappin, how excited are you about this move and how different is it from uh, in what you've been doing recently? Yeah, actually really thrilled about it. Um, it's been ongoing for a couple of weeks, speaking to, to the manager and the chairman. Uh, I'm delighted to finally get it done and get back to what I love doing and that's playing games of football. And will it be straight in? How, how, I mean, how? because you obviously had a, a bad injury and getting back to fitness, how difficult is that? Yeah, it's, uh, I'm, I'm not match fit, if you like. Uh, I'm a bit of back fit training. Um, the injuries in the past as far as I'm concerned and it's looking forward but uh, match fitness is going to take a wee bit of time and when the manager sees fit to put me in then, then I'm happy with that but like I said I'm here to play my part in, in everything and if I can help in any way if it's on the pitch or off the pitch uh, I'm just really looking forward to it all. Yeah this strikes me as the kind of move that you do if you're really hungry to be playing and, and getting back out on a football pitch at a proper level. I think if you ask any player that's all they want to do you still have that hunger and that that feeling your, your gut and that you want to play and you want to compete and I'm no different um, I spoke to many guys in the game that always give you advice play as long as you can and the opportunity to come here as I said to work with the manager somebody I've had a lot of success with in the past I know how he operates so I'm really excited about that but I, I just want to get back playing games of football and there's a potential there for a bit of coaching as well which is the, 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 the transition in the game from, from player to coach but um, as we said in the press conference, we're not, we're not coming here to take it easy. As you say, it's still got that hunger to go and win games, uh, and we'll continue that. Grant will be the same. Um, we've been that way our whole career, and that won't change at all. I mean, this is an Orange City reunion, isn't it, with you, Grant, <laughs> but also Ian as well, who uh, the club are doing really well under him, and you just mentioned how big a draw he is to to bring you here. I mean, what, what kind of guy is he? Because he did, he did so well under Paul Lambert yeah, and Orange. I think that is the biggest draw. I've said that previously. Um, Speaking to him, knowing the way he works, uh, he's coaching, he's now wanting to be a manager in his own right and I'm sure he'll be very successful at that. I've had a little bit of success so far, there's still a long, long way to go here, um, but the opportunity to come and work with him again um, after that successful time we had at Norwich City, as you mentioned, was, was just incredible and I can't wait to, to, to work with him again, as you say. You two coming into this club, the expectation levels will be going through the roof. Have you ever had that before? Because it's something different, isn't it? Yeah, I, th I think any club you're at, there's an expectancy level. Um, there might be that because of maybe they've been played with Norwich City, the bigger club in the county, if you like. But we're just treating it as, as we always will. Nothing will change for us. It's, it's just a, it's a game. We're going to our dressing room. It'll be the same as before. With a group of lads that are, are going to want to go and win games of football. So the expectancy thing might be coming from the outside, but we will just concentrate on what goes on on the pitch. And at this point in your career, how do you look at this this move? Because uh, it does it get to the point where you're thinking, well, I might not have many clubs in, I don't know how many seasons I've got, how many yeah. games I'm going to get to play? Yeah, I think everything just added up. Um, I spoke to my wife about it, my parents. Um, and as you say, I had a bit of an injury last year, but I just want to get back playing. I want to get playing with a smile on my face, and I'll all do that with the manager here. But I still want to go and win games of football. Um, people, as I say, we're not coming here for an easy ride, and it's a simple option. It's not the case of that at all. Um, and everything added up, as I said, and I just can't wait to get going now. And uh, maybe most importantly, are they still going to allow you time to sort out your pilot license uh, yeah, education? It, it's something that, as you, as you say, Michael, that I've been doing for a while now. Um, and with it being part time, uh, it's important that when you're away from here, you're still looking after yourself. But it gives me the opportunity to do other things. Uh, and that is one of them and I'll, I'll continue to do that and just finally in terms of coaching clearly that, that is a draw here and you want to do yeah. that at, obviously Norwich City down the road as well I mean, would you like future involvement in, in the club is that uh, somewhere you see something going I'm not even thinking about it mate. I've just signed here today and all my f attention and, and my focus is on Kings Lynn um, like I said we've got a game tomorrow night and, and I can't wait to come along to that and, and just can't wait to be part of it all and as you say the, the coaching opportunity to learn from the manager is going to be so beneficial for me in the long run uh, and I can't wait for it to get started and you will have a lot of goodwill from the Norwich fans as well won't they they'll be keeping a close eye on what you and Grant do here yeah I'm, I'm sure they will I'm sure that will create some kind of attention once it gets out there but uh, as I say we're just concentrating on and coming here we've spoke about it together I know Grant spoke to his wife and, and family about things and we were both discussed as I said coming here and it's the right time for us to, to, to come here uh, and we both we're both really excited about it brilliant time good luck with yeah, it cheers so